the torment of the akhirah, he'll put it in the dunya for a short period, and then they go back to Allah completely free of any tribulation or punishment. Maybe it's the places that aren't being afflicted, that deserve to be afflicted, that should be worried. This is the way Muslims traditionally looked at things. When the Mughal came down, when the Mongols came down, they didn't say, these evil Mongols. They said, This is a punishment God has sent to us because of our wrong actions. That's how they looked at it. Muslims don't look at that anymore. Evil America, evil Israel, evil... Okay, good. Allahumma marika al murka man tasha. You, Allah put them in power. He says He gives power to whomever He pleases. Muslim had it. If Muslims had nuclear weapons right now with the idiots that we have, we would have nuclear conflagrations all over. Allah knows what He's doing. Allah knows who He gives power to. Yes, they abuse their power, but to what degree? Who would be worse? People want the destruction of America? Well, let's see what happens when China gets the world power. See if there's going to be an Abu Ghraib that you hear about. See if there's going to be any way, recourse to redressing any wrongs. Allah Ta'ala Alam, I don't know. But sometimes the worst things are, are answered prayers. <laughs> we don't know. It's a different way of looking at the world. People don't want to look at it that way. But I read the Quran, and the Quran, it comes back to me. When they were asked, where did this calamity come from? Allah says, It's from your own selves. It didn't say, oh, it's from those evil Quraysh. <laughs> those evil Quraysh. No, Allah wanted the Quraysh to become Muslim. دخل عليهم رسول الله ماذا تقولوا تقولون فيا أخ كريم ابن أخ كريم you are a noble son of a noble إذهب اليوم فأنتم الطلقاء you're free today I forgive you he said what لا تثريب عليكم he said what Yusuf said to his brothers who threw him in a well and left him to die لا تثريب عليكم because that's the state of believers when they get angry, yes, we get angry. But they realize, what am I really getting angry at? At a test that God sent me? Who am I really angry at? See, you can be humanly angry, but who are you really angry about? If everything is a test from Allah, then who are you really angry at?